What are you working on? Hey, I'm doing something important. <gasps> well, this seems to be the reality of the current times. It is a given that enterprises require accelerated trips to train AI models on a large scale. Tech giant Microsoft has been reportedly working on their in-house chip to support AI projects for OpenAI and internal teams. This comes in light of how tech companies are required to shell out colossal amounts of money to fund GPUs like Nvidia A100 or H100 to train AI models. If you have been following the developments in this space, you would know that Amazon and Google have already built their in-house accelerator chips. Amazon Web Services developed Inferentia and Graviton accelerator chips for deep learning inference applications and training workloads respectively. So does Google, flaunting its own AI accelerator called the Tensor Processing Unit or TPU for neural network and machine learning workloads. One might wonder, is Microsoft late to the AI accelerator game? Maybe not, considering how the organization is actively involved with OpenAI. The Microsoft AI chip, which is tentatively named Athena, will not only assist OpenAI, but will also improve the offerings of its own company. Athena will assist in optimizing AI workloads for Microsoft's internal use and significantly improve the quality of their cloud offerings. It will also reduce the company's dependence on GPUs and their manufacturers. It doesn't stop with that. Athena is expected to improve Microsoft Azure customer experience as it will potentially add value to Azure's already existing portfolio of AI services. Azure's OpenAI services and Microsoft's new accelerator chip will make the cloud service a one-stop shop for enterprise customers. I will catch you in another episode. Bye.